brought to you by Data Health and Wellness Center. Transform, educate, inspire, empower. Hi, my name is Cindy Brown. I'm on staff at Otterbein United Methodist Church here in Hagerstown, and my position is Director of Program. For a long time, I was pushing my way through each day. Um, my energy was going down, my ability just to physically function was declining, and I finally, in October of 2015, hit physically and emotionally my rock bottom and decided it was no one else's business but mine if I was going to change that, and it was totally up to me. And so I went to some friends who had gone through the Ideal Protein Plan, the protocol, and they looked fantastic. I had asked them about it before, and they gave me the paperwork, and I looked at it and said, oh, I cannot do this. So when I hit my rock bottom, I thought, let's explore that again, and this time I truly was ready. It was October of 2015 when I finally actually met with, um, with Chateau and Susan and began my journey. As to what the whole wonderful list of guidance foods, and direction as to uh, can present what and the whole be available food, to us, but uh, it was still up to to him to spice it and season it the way we like. It still and so our whole menu to him to spice it up. And, season and we have eaten fantastic so meals all the way through. Our whole shopping adventure in the grocery store changed because instead of buying the same old, same old every week and kind of hogging it down. We were decisive about what we were going to eat. We planned everything and we ate what we planned. And the progress proved that we were doing the right thing. Week after week, losing weight, feeling more energetic. Within the first month of following the protocol, we were both off of our blood pressure medications. I was off of my cholesterol medication. We looked at each other one evening and said, do you feel like the fog has lifted in your brain or something, like you can think more clearly? And we both discovered by sharing little tiny changes we were noticing that big changes were really happening. We have friends who are going through the Ideal Protein Protocol and there are clinics all over the place. You can go online, you can find clinics and we are very blessed. We feel very blessed and very fortunate that it was the Data Endocrine Wellness Center and the, that specific clinic that we were directed to because, and I only have my experience with them that I can personally attest to, but I can tell you that the coaching from them was, was stellar. It made the difference from one week to the next of us feeling confident in what we were doing. If we had a question we knew, we didn't have to hesitate that our coaches with data, the data's office, were going to be there for us and answer our questions. Within a month of losing at least 10 pounds, my first 10 pounds, and going off of my blood pressure medications and my cholesterol medication already, and having a physician who was very ecstatic about that and encouraging, I realized that good things were happening. And the only way for me to imagine getting to my goal weight was not to think in terms of, oh my gosh, 300 pounds down to one something. I, I couldn't fathom that. I had to break it down and go in increments. And so I imagined getting to 28 something. And once I dropped into to the 289 range, then I started picturing and imagining two sevens and then two sixes. And so in 10 pound increments, I visualized getting to my goal weight, which actually initially was just to see one nine anything. I only wanted to see that there was no longer a two in front of my weight. So when I accomplished that, then I had to start imagining one eights and one sevens, and that was very exciting. But there were so many other things that I journaled and I chronicled and noticed along the way. With each 10 or even with each five or six pounds, I would notice little things. For example, the first time we were able to sit in a booth in a restaurant, and we up until that time would have to reserve a table. We couldn't fit into a booth and would be embarrassed when a waitress would try to squeeze us into one anyway. And so that was a huge celebration, the first time we sat in a booth again at a restaurant. Uh, the first time I was able to even imagine going from the women's department to the missy's department to buy clothing. That was a bit of a transition, not as much for my body, but for my mind. I couldn't fathom in my mind, even though my body was changing, that I could actually now fit into Missy's size clothing. It's now January of 2017. At this point, I've lost 136 pounds. I am at my goal weight. 
I am within one week of fully being on the maintenance phase of the ideal protein protocol. Um, the folks at Data Wellness Center are coaching me very well from one phase to the next and the next, and I have no reason to believe I won't continue to be successful. 